Yo guys, what up? Thor's not X here. All right, so today for this video, I'm gonna I'm gonna do a type of video that's like in Terraria, but it's a custom build of someone. So today it will be Thor, the god of thunder. Whoa, bit of lag there. So Thor, the god of thunder, uses this hammer called the Mjolnir. So the items I use for him. Uh, don't, well, I, I tried to fit the items best like best as I could for uh, Thor, so it's not perfect, but I mean, it's close enough that I think to the God of Thunder, so for his main weapon, I would use the Paladin Hammer, because that's like his hammer, Mjolnir, which he uses to throw back and forth, but um, you can't really um, melee people with it, so just testing with it. It's a pretty quick damage output. Kills the monsters quickly. Alright, so the next item would be this legendary Spectre Hammer. Spectre Hammer. And I set these, um, at the, uh, what is it? Set these enhancements, enhancements to the people. Uh, I mean to the weapons, to their best enhancements. So you could copy this. Legendary, legendary. So pick axe and hand axe of Spectre are legendary. For the uh, magic stuff, I use the golden shower. I'm not really sure if that's close enough, but that's what I choose. The next one is the Nimbus Rod, because he's like awesome and he rains down thunder. The only thing I hate about it is it doesn't rain down thunder, because it's called the Nimbus Rod and it has a thunderbolt right in the weapon. Alright, so another exception for uh, weapon picking is the Shroomite Digging Claw, which I don't know why I picked, but I just picked it. It could either be the Pixar as well. So, you would also want uh, other torches with you, carry some torches with every character, because it's pretty annoying to see in a cave or something and not even see anything. But these builds are not supposed to be strong or like anything about adventure. I just, I'm just doing a custom build on people. So don't take an effect on like adventure like this could kill a boss or anything. I mean Thor could probably kill the destroyer easily because the paladin's hammer is effective. But continuing on, I always put a rod of discord on every character I play. So I could easily teleport. So if I wanted to go here, yeah there you go, teleport. But you gotta look, oh I was just about to say watch out for your chaos state. Which um, is the effect here. Using Rod of Discord will take life. So yeah. You would also want a magic mirror. So you could get to your house easily. If you're stuck in a cave or something. You could use that. For potions. I would use a greater healing potion. It's the best potion. I think. For maybe. Restores 150 life. For potions. Um, for that effect you. I would use a swiftness potion. So it could be really fast. And an iron skin potion so his defense is better because it's Thor man he, he I don't see him dying <laughs> at all because I mean he's got all right so exceptional items for Thor could be gravity globe which would be just a fun item just to screw around with your friends or something because if I equip it you could easily do this oh god no 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 <clears throat> oh Whew. Okay, can I? No, no! Oh crap! 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 I'm dead! I'm dead! I'm dead! I'm dead! Let's like do a. Oh god! Dang it! Okay, I'm not dead. All right, sweet. I told you Thor was a god. All right, so yeah, exceptional items are gravity globe. Uh, I I made these all menacing because I want all the damage I put on Thor. So that would be the gravity globe, mechanical glove and fire gauntlet you could choose between the fire gauntlet or mechanical glove depends on what you would like fire damage or speed or yeah melee knockback all right so for the armor i use turtle helmet turtle scale mail and turtle leggings because it gives you a lot of defense and the enemies would more likely attack you which store pretty much beats up everything he sees uh i would also choose the beetle helmet for another set of armor because it gives you a lot of defense but you would get beetles around you which i don't really see thor having beetles around him 
So for the social, to actually make him look like Thor, I would use the red cape right here. And uh, I would dye all these black, except for the cape, obviously. I mean, I could show the boots, but it doesn't really look good. So I would use the adamantite headgear for the head treasure hunter shirt. Because uh, I've seen some pictures, he doesn't really have sleeves. And for the pants, you could basically use any pants, but I use the treasure hunter pants. For the um, accessories, I use the bundle balloons, frostbark boots, avenger emblem, warrior emblem, and destroyer emblem. You could change these all you want, but I chose bundle balloons because he does fly, but I didn't want to put wings on him because Thor doesn't have wings that I know of. Or if he does, then I must be like not on my date for gods because I'm, I'm pretty sure he doesn't have wings only on his helmet so there you guys go here's thor hope you guys enjoy and yeah thor the god of thunder no i'm not gonna kill myself nice